Hey guys, Javen here. So in today's video, I'm going to be sharing to you what exactly is a tubal haircut and just some history to go along with it. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day. If you like what you see, be sure to smash that subscribe button and turn on post notifications to never miss a brand new video again. So the tubal haircut as I see it is an improved version of an undercut. All there is to it is that your sides are shaved, your lower back is shaved, and the top you leave it however long you want. So this haircut focuses your eyes on the crown of your hair and it just gives you the elongated look so your faces look longer. The tubal hairstyle is really versatile. You can make it shorter, medium, or longer length. Over here right now, I will consider this a medium to longer length hairstyle right now for a tubal haircut. Growing out the top of my hair for a few months now and just been shaving the sides by myself at home. So as you can see, it's pretty long at the front right now, just covering my eyebrows. Another thing about the tubal haircut is that you kind of look like a mushroom, coconut, or like you put a wig on your head or a helmet. So as you can see, my hair is just like all long, so it kind of looks like yeah, I just put a wig on. Now the tubal hairstyle got popular in Korea, and as you can see in all the Korean dramas, you can see a lot of guys rocking this hairstyle. Pretty girls around me, they can never seem to phase me. Nope, but somehow you got me thinking about you lately. You can also see Korean idols, many K-pop idols rocking this hair. So this hairstyle originated in Asia, and then it slowly spread to North America and beyond. Now when I go outside and I walk on the streets, I can see a lot of people rocking this hair. Asians, non-Asians, like even girls rock this hairstyle now. I even see some older guys having this hairstyle. It basically just makes them look younger. I feel like hairstyles that have bangs like this makes you look younger than without bangs. Just makes me look 50 years old, you know? <laughs> For a tubal hairstyle, there's many ways you can style your hair. For one, you can just go with a natural look like me. Right out of the shower, just blow dry a little bit. And there you go, just a natural look. You can also use wax or gel just to mold your hair a little bit so you can go out the way you like it. Or you can also dye your hair just to spice up the look a little bit. Some people also perm their hair. So if you perm your hair, your hair basically will become more wavy in length and it just makes you look like this. So yeah, as you can see, there are many different ways you can play with this hair. The longer your hair, the more options you can play with. So you can use like hair straighteners just to straighten your hair or make it curly or do whatever you want with your hair. As for myself, I just really love this hairstyle because it's just really easy to maintain for me and it's easy for me to cut at home. I wouldn't call myself a good barber. However, this hairstyle is just really easy to cut. Basically, I just shave the sides of my hair and then on the top, I just use some um, thinning shears as well as just trim the sides a little bit. It's also such a versatile hairstyle that I can leave it down like this, move it back, move it to the side, make it curly, make it not curly, make it wavy, make it not wavy. I can perm it if I want to. I can make it longer in the top or shorter depending on how I like my hair. The tubal hairstyle also suits many different face shapes. So what are you ready for guys? Just do it. <laughs> anyway, don't forget to check out my other tubal hairstyle videos down below. I hope this video gave you some value. Thanks for watching and check back next time. And this is how I make a thumbnail. What'd you say, Tiff? You're ugly. <laughs> Never wanna let you go. Deserve you. Let me, huh? I'm singing. <laughs>